Yo, what's up, y'all? Uh, so I just wanted to make this video and uh, just give a update about what I've been doing lately um, on this journey. You know that is that is life. So um, just kind of put everything in perspective. Uh, this fall, this last fall, like starting in September. I was working wine harvest in um, in Oregon, uh, up near Portland, in a town called McMinnville, um, which is in the Willamette Valley, a uh, pretty well-known wine region. And I was helping out a winery there, and this was seasonal work, so uh, it ended. So my job ended, and. Um, now I'm back in California um, and I'm looking for work so I'm staying with family uh, looking for work and but continuing all the things that I normally do uh, such as a liver cleanse um, but also looking ahead to what um, what else you know whatever whatever knowledge I would like to pick up and something I've been really passionate about lately even though I don't like the word passionate but it's a good description of what's going on is that um, I've been learning French so uh, I've been doing using Duolingo right now I'm like on a 30 day streak so that's 30 days of every day for some period of time um, picking up a new language and um, also been meeting up with a group so I could get into conversation because from what I've researched that's uh, extremely valuable um, so I've been doing that um, yeah just kind of immersing myself in that language and that culture and uh, you know saddened by you know what happened to in in, uh, in Paris you know, even though, you know, there's a lot of different perspectives on, you know, you know, there's a lot of different opinions. Like, it's not just uh, black and white about, you know, what happened, like, but it was in either case, like, you never want to see people, you never want to see anybody hurt. I don't think that's a good way to do, to solve any, um, any issue out there, you know, uh, death. You know, there's a lot of ways to duel it out without um, resorting to violence. In any case, um, I love French culture and I want to return there. And, um, oh, that's another thing I did. Right after harvest, I went to Europe. Um, and I might have mentioned this in other videos, but I went to, uh, went to Sweden. I went to, well, I went to Stockholm. I went to Sweden. And I went to London and I went to Paris and I also went to uh, Normandy uh, to a town called Cannes um, and there I was uh, looking to uh, check out the region that makes uh, hard, uh, cider there, cidre. Uh, so in any case, um, so that is that. Uh, so um, yeah. <laughs> So now, so I'm learning French. Um, when I was in McMinnville, I was learning how to swim with my eye set on learning how to surf. So that is something that I hope to do. Um, my goal is to, well, I'm in the Bay Area. So I need, and um, my goal, and I'm, I don't know why people kind of like, don't want to talk about where they're at. Um, so anyways, I'm in, and I think I just picked up on that, but I'm in San Jose, California. And um, I will go to, uh, I'm hoping to go back to San Francisco, live back in San Francisco. And um, there, and so related to, related to swimming, my eye has always been on surfing. I mean, lately it's been on surfing, so I hope to, when I get back there, because uh, it's closer to the ocean, that I can start surfing. Um, after I learn a little bit more how to swim. Um, so that's the goal there, get a job. 
um, doing something that I can enjoy. And uh, right now I have an interview for a uh, for a uh, like a, a a coffee company, and um, I hope to get that job because it kind of fits with what I do in the wine industry. It's just like like I like in in winemaking. There's like a lot of cleaning and um, sort of assisting. <laughs> and trying to make something very delicious and that's something similar that I'd be doing uh, with this coffee job and I like coffee too I also like hot cocoa a lot <laughs> um, but in any case so um, something that fits my my um, sort of my skill set got a bird singing behind me I was a hummingbird sweet uh, <laughs> So, uh, yeah, um, so we get, so that's the plan, get back to San Francisco, uh, swim, surf, uh, learn French, um, continue to live or cleanse, uh, just started, uh, on the first day of, uh, drinking, of preparation, so drinking the apple, apple juice, um, so, uh, Related to that coffee job, I have an interview tomorrow, so wish me luck. Uh, they seem pretty happy to have me, <laughs> but um, I mean, pretty happy to have me come up, so um, I'm excited too, and uh, I think things will go well. Um, so yeah, just like French, swim, surf, get healthier. Uh, continue on this path. Uh, I'm trying to think what else I want to do in my life. Oh, I want to start a hard cider business. So, um, yeah, I'm just I'm just hoping like with this job, you know, continue to incubate uh, the cider business that I'm that's in my mind that um, I hope to come to uh, fruition. Um, so right now. Yeah, I think I've really developed parts of my branding because I, I developed a logo, so I'm pretty happy with how the logo looks. And um, I have the general idea of uh, like the, the cider that I make, the product that I want to make. Um, I need to work out things in terms of, and I think this will come later, like in terms of legality, but I need to find a place to make the cider because you can't just make it at home. If you want to take it to um, take it to market, um, I think I need to work a little bit more on the product itself, the the method, um, the method that will lead to the the, the kind of um, the kind of taste that I want, the kind of flavor that I want to have in the product. So that needs to be developed. Um, a lot more and do some do some testing there because uh, uh, you know I've made some cider and it's it's been good but I think it could be I think it could be better um, and I think with some of the methods that I've learned uh, and perhaps I could share that with you guys as I as I go along in this process um, some of the methods that I've learned uh, I think I can make a really good cider um, that maybe people haven't had before and they'll be, uh, you know, they'll be delighted with. So, um, yeah. So that's the plan for now. Um, I'm just going to cut this video short. So instead of just thinking and, um, you know, if I need to say more about that, about what I'm trying to do or wanting to do, uh, I'll let you know. All right.